Hello everybody, my name is James, hope you're all doing well, and welcome back to another video. So Fernando Alonso has requested a new qualifying format, and Max Verstappen has responded to comments made by Lewis Hamilton. Make sure to like the video, and subscribe for more Formula 1 content, but let's jump straight into the news. So let's start with Alonso, who said he wants to see the return of single lap qualifying at shorter circuits to help eradicate impeding incidents. Now this was last seen in 2003 when drivers would set lap times in championship order on Friday, then the slowest would take to the track on Saturday to repeat the process. And it does essentially mean that drivers will get a clear track, meaning there's no risk of impeding. Alonso said, There are a few options to improve this, one is single lap qualifying like in the past. That will be ideal in my opinion, because only one car on track with full TV coverage for that lap for everyone's sponsors. This creates a little bit of drama in case of weather changes between qualifying. You could see pole position in different cars, with different names, so that was my preferred option. Now on the one hand, it could be a good idea given the amount of times we see cars get in the way of each other, like at the last qualifying in Canada, numerous drivers were investigated by the stewards for disrupting laps, but you also have to remember that a one-shot qualifying could lead to issues. For example, rain might fall a few minutes into the session and therefore only like three drivers may get a lap when it's bone dry, while everyone else gets stuck in the pits waiting to go out for their turn. So they're instantly disadvantaged, but in the current format, if rain is forecast, drivers can all get out at the same time to get a lap time in, and whatever happens is fair game. So for me, I don't think one shot qualifying is something we'll see introduced. But let's move on to Lewis Hamilton who's called on the FIA to mandate a start time when F1 teams can begin development on next season's car. Now Hamilton made these claims amid Red Bull's dominance. Like they've won all the races so far this season and pretty much have the title wrapped up. As a result, they can probably afford to focus on 2024 early. But Hamilton feels this could lock in a further advantage for Red Bull. He said, They're so far ahead, they don't have to make any changes to this car anymore. I think the FIA should probably put a time when everyone is allowed to start developing on next year's car. Say August 1st, that's when everybody can start so that no one can get an advantage on the next year, because that sucks. It would make more sense. Now while we all want to see a closer fight for victories, you do have to remember that Mercedes dominated for many years and no rule like this was enforced. And Max Verstappen responded to Lewis Hamilton by saying, We weren't talking about that when he was winning his championships, right? so I don't think we should now. That's how Formula 1 works. But what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. But that's going to be the video from me today. Thank you ever so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. And until the next one, take care.